Hey guys, what's up? It's Victorian. Today I want to show you guys how to paint your dinos and how to paint um, canvases with templates. Um, so if you want to paint your uh, spinal, like, I don't know, like a rainbow spinal, or you want to paint your raptor like a Yoshi, or your T-Rex for us, a Yoshi for all that matters. There you go. Or you want to make really cool paintings. Which we do hear a lot on my server because it's quite funny to actually do this kind of stuff. So if you want to um, do that as well, then yeah, this is the guy to watch. So let's get into it. So first thing, what we're going to do, what we're going to paint today is we're going to change this giga because this is ugly as hell. So what we're going to do, the first thing you need to do is download Arc Paint Converter. You can find it in the Steam Workshop, but don't worry, I will leave you a link down below where you can download it. So this is our painting program. This is the program we're gonna load in all the uh, all the paintings, all the templates. Um, I have all the paint on me, all the colors on me. I always have that when I start painting, so I'm not missing out on any resources. And then you want to decide what you want to paint. Now um, we want to get a giga done. The site I'm using to get all my templates is arttemplates.com. Um, there are two templates who are not in as far as I'm, well, uh, as I'm aware. Uh, let me see. It was the the Griffin is not in. The let's see what was it? The Griffin is not in not in. The Uteranus is not in yet. There are no templates for the Uteranus yet. There is no template for uh, the Griffin yet and there is no template for uh, what's the other one called let me have a quick check. I can see it on the website. Don't overlook it. It's the Argentavis. Because of the model update of the Argentavis, um, they are, there are RG uh, templates. They don't fit anymore. They don't work. I'll t I tried to make this one. Um, you only get like 25 or 50% of it done uh, because of the model update. I don't think the Deodon is in as well. Let me check if it's in... Um, yeah, so it's kind of out of date. I hope people will start making templates soon. Um, we'll see. But the Giga is in. A lot of the dinos are in. About 90% of the dinos are in. So we want to do the Giga. Uh, Gigantosaur. And I want to make a really cool one. I really like this black and blue one. This one is really what I like. So I think I'm going to go with this. As you can see, you can have all these colors. Uh, this is beautiful as well. This is really nice. Um, yeah, you can make a rainbow as well. You can make whatever you want, basically. The only thing you have to keep in mind that sometimes the background color, like I use the black with blood smears, is the first one I tried, but it's meant for a black giga. Uh, the person who made this only put the red stripes on there and he had a black giga, so it worked out for him. But I have a green giga, and because I have a green giga, basically what he made is only a template with... Um, for the right stripes and he did not he didn't put the paint in to paint first what he should have done was paint the entire giga black then put in the red stripes but because he had a black spino he only uh, put in the red stripes and because of that um he only saved the template with the red stripes meaning he just puts red stripes on any color giga since mine is green you get a green and a green uh, giga with a red stripe so that looks really bad so we're not gonna pick that one again so what I'm going to do is I'm gonna pick this one this is the camo arctic guess so yeah yep so what you want to do you click on that and you click on this link you're gonna download that there we go come that's what we want to remember okay so it goes to my downloads oh sorry so I go to my paint converter going to open and I go to my downloads now we know it was uh, Camelzol Giga. Yes. We say open. Now, usually when you use a dyno template, usually your canvas will be set to dyno and painting canvas. But sometimes people um, save it wrong or sometimes the program is misreading it and it will put it up like flag or it will put up like pumpkin or whatever. So it doesn't match. So if you download a, a dyno template, Always make sure that it is on dinos and painting. Just make sure to check that. Okay, now we need to save this. 
And how we're going to save this is that the step you're going to do next, we have this loaded in. What you're going to do, we're going to make this a personal gear template. So what we do, we're going to select some black, put it up here. And we'll select it red, I wanted to use black, whatever, it doesn't matter. You just put some paint on there. And we're going to uh, save paint and we're going to name this uh, Giga. So now I made this file Giga file. And what I'm going to do is you're going to save this. You go to C, Program Files, times 86 if you have Windows 64. Then you go to Steam. Then you go to Steam Apps. You go to uh, Common. Arch should have gamed saved my paintings. Then we're gonna look for uh, Giga. Now, I already tried it once, so I know that uh, this one is called C1 because this was the last one I tried. So I'm gonna select C1 in this case. But normally, if this is the first time you play the Giga and you call it Giga, it will be Giga Giant. Um, in this case, because this is the second one I'm saving, it's uh, Core C.1. So we're gonna save this. I'm going to replace it. This is Dutch, but it's asking me to replace it. Yes. Now I'm going to close this. Now I'm going to load paint from this uh, this one. And I can see here, this is the red and black. And this is the blue, black and white one. This is the one I, I want to. So I can actually select which one I want. And now I'm going to load painting. And it's going to start painting it. So now we're going to hang back. And I'm hoping everything will turn out correctly this time. Not really, not exactly the way I want to. Yeah, it's not too bad. It doesn't seem, I don't know if the Giga had a update recently, but because of the um, green background of the Giga, it looks a little bit different. But I guess this is all right. There you go. So you can do this with, um, basically with almost any dino. I did the Spino who has a better coverage over here. I did this before I made a video. I should have made a video with this one. Look at that, it looks actually amazing. So sometimes it depends on which skin uh, you choose. The skin was apparently not entirely filled up. It's not too bad, but we're doing um, different stuff. We did the Yoshi for the Raptor, we also did, I believe we have, let me teleport, just to show you, because it's kind of a shit example to be honest, I'm kind of disappointed that I'm showing you such a bad example of what's going on. Let me check, if I'm right I have a T-Rex or a Giga somewhere over here. Yeah, there he is, this is a T-Rex I painted before. So yeah, usually it works. It depends on the template, how the template is set up, but you get really good results. So don't let the Giga scare you off. Okay, let's dive into some um, painting of some other stuff. Let me go to back to main base. I just I should have selected a different uh, different tem uh, template. So let me jump down. So now I want to. Well, get a canvas done. So how are we gonna do a canvas? No, it's not really that hard. Let me check where if we have some canvases left. Might be in the painting room. Construction. Don't know if the guys put it in there. Like you can see, we're making loads of paint because we're painting something like every day. Um, as you can see, the guys are going nuts. They absolutely love it. Uh, there you go, there's just so much going on. Okay, I'm just gonna craft, I thought I, do I have one on my inventory now? I apologize. So I'm gonna make a canvas. Uh, so, uh, let me craft, no, let me just craft one for now, that's fine. We're using the automated arc, makes life easy. There you go, okay. So I'm gonna hang one up here. This is my wall so far. So I want to have them next to each other. So it's basically this same, it's the same principle. Like this is your canvas. So I'm gonna select apply paint. Uh, excuse me. Oh, sorry, region one, and apply paint. Okay, you should have paint on it now. It doesn't want to select the color. I don't know why. Doesn't matter. So now I'm going to load. No, sorry, I'm doing it wrong. 
So now I'm gonna save this. Canvas. Uh, I'm just gonna call this Canvas 5. So no, which one? Because we did so many. So Canvas 5, I'm gonna set this. Yeah? Okay. Now it's the same thing. I'm going back to my paint converter. And let me check the name of the file I want to download. Okay, got it. So I just downloaded a picture random of the internet. Um, let me see. There you go. Now, as you can see, this is set to Dino right now. This is quite a big picture though, so I'm not entirely sure it will fit, but it sh should go on small sign. That's my phone, I'm sorry. Um, I'm looking right now, the billboard is too big. Yeah, it should be small sign, I'm just checking. Or multi-canvas. Oh, multi-canvas, this is the multi-canvas. So now we're gonna save this. It's the same story. We're going to this PC, C, program files. We're going to um, Steam. Where is it? Steam apps, common arc, shoot a game, saved, my paintings. And then we're going to Canvas and Canvas 5, just like I named it. And then we're gonna replace this. And now I'm going to say load, and I select canvas 5, and it says, and then go load painting. There we go. So let it paint, just let it uh, sit there. I'm hoping it will work out. Some pictures work better than others. Try to keep them a simple color wise because art, I mean, you need all the different colors, of course, to mix stuff. Ah, oh, this is working out pretty good, actually. And let me. There you go. So this is how you, and it's the same thing with a canvas, like I painted my logo on here. It works the same thing, you just download a picture, you'd be like, I want to, you do the same thing, you apply paint on it, you say it's the same, the only thing you do in, instead of putting it on billboard, uh, on multi canvas, you're putting it on a billboard, then it will stretch it out, and then it fits on a metal billboard like you see here with my logo, or like you see in the back over here there's a billboard as well so that's it guys that that is how you paint your dinos your canvases your billboards whatever you want to paint with um sorry i'm getting spammed on steam i apologize anything you want to paint with templates um, when it comes down to painting things like this what cat day what cat has done you just select regions um now i don't want to fuck this up so and you just select this with red and then you say apply paint and it will paint it that's it um so this is not doesn't have anything to do with the program or with the templates so yeah hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please give the thumbs up subscribe to my channel and i'll hope to see you guys on another video or on one of my live streams have a great day wherever you got wherever you are guys Bye bye